This is the Combat FG 650 watt ATX 3.1 sold by Superflower with a current MSRP of $110 US. It is a fully modular ATX 3.1 power supply with a single fan mode. We tested two samples of this power supply and both stopped functioning before we completed our test so we cannot recommend it. For more information on the partial results and failures of the unit, see the product page on the LTT Labs website. The power supply comes in reasonable packaging and measures 150 by 86 by 140 millimeters. Considering cable flexibility, it has an effective depth of 180 millimeters. The Combat FG 650 watt is accompanied by the accessories as shown and supported by a 10-year warranty. This warranty period is as expected for a power supply of this class. The fully modular cables are of acceptable quality. They have plastic insulation and are quite stiff. They may not be the easiest to handle while building and cable managing your computer. The provided cable set includes a single 12-volt 2x6 cable, allowing it to power all types of high-wattage GPUs. LTT Labs conducted all of the following testing at an ambient temperature of 20 degrees Celsius. The full test suite, including tests at extended temperature ranges, is available on the lab's website linked in the description. But before we get to the test results, here's a message from our sponsor. Thanks to Private Internet Access for sponsoring this video. We've been using their secure high-speed VPN for years, and you can too. Get a special deal by going to pia.com slash psucircuit. The Combat FG 650 watt carries an 80 plus gold rating and we have measured 91% efficiency at 50% of its maximum rated load. That is equivalent to power supplies in a similar class. Throughout the full rated output power range of 650 watts, there was a 0.116 voltage drop on the 12 volt rail inside of ATX specifications and better than other power supplies we've tested. The rest of the output rails met ATX specifications. The stability will provide a steady platform for the operation of other components in the computer. The peak-to-peak -peak signal ripple of the fully loaded power supply's 12-volt rail was slightly high at 43 millivolts, while the 5-volt and 3.3-volt rails had signal ripple of 28 millivolts and 36 millivolts respectively. Modern power supplies typically have no issue complying with ATX ripple specifications, and this unit is no different. We test a power supply's resilience to momentary power dropouts and ripples using our brownout test that interrupts the input power for a few milliseconds. This allows us to measure how long of a power dropout the sample can sustain without interrupting the output power. The Combat FG 650 watt was measured to withstand a 12 millisecond and 13 millisecond dropout at full rated load for 115 volt and 230 volt inputs respectively. This is shorter than desired and may be more susceptible to poor power quality. The excursion test momentarily applies up to 200% of the rated load to test a power supply's ability to support components that may temporarily require more than their rated current. The Combat FG 650 watt withstood a subset of the excursions but failed with others. It is compatible with most systems but may struggle with high-end hardware connected. We do not recommend the Combat FG 650 watt ATX 3.1 because of its failures while testing the protections. For full specifications and test results, follow the link to the product page on the LTT Labs website.